What's up guys? Earlier today I put out a video about how to switch blunt and why switch blunts are so much easier than regular blunt to fakies. So in this video I'm going to talk about two tips that can help you learn blunt to fakies because it's a really intimidating trick. Sometimes no matter how hard you try you just cannot commit to landing this trick because it's such a mental battle. The first thing I had to do to land a blunt to fakie was learn to actually ollie out of the blunt. So for so many years when I was trying this trick, I was popping the back, but I wasn't dragging my foot forward and evening the board out. So I would just pop and expect to do a little manual back down, but that just wasn't working for me. It worked switch easy. I could do the little nose manual out, but doing the manual out, I never had my foot pointed, so I could never really get it. But the thing is, you have to actually pop and drag your foot like you're doing an ollie, like you're trying to do a nose bash back into the coping. Like, you know how people do lean to tails where they grab the board, slap their tail, act like you're doing that with the nose. And uh, that'll, that's gonna help you actually be able to pop out of it and even the board out. And it's gonna give you more pop so that you can clear your wheels over the coping. The second thing that really helped me learn this trick is at first I was learning pivot fakies and I was doing a lot of sliding. So I was so used to coming in to the ramp sideways and going to fakie. So if you know what a shifty is, you can do a blunt and kind of a shifty ollie. Now what this is doing is it's helping you get your front wheels in without having to ollie as much. See how much distance there is here? This is over 15 inches on the wheelbase on this board, and that's a lot to pull back in, especially to a small transition like this. But if you ollie and do a shifty, that's a lot less distance. It's like nine inches compared to over 15 inches of space. So ollie, do a little shifty, and you're not, you don't have to ollie as much, and it's not as scary because you're coming back in forward. Your shoulders are kind of facing the way you're coming in. The way I figured this out is this is a really tight, quick little ramp. It's hard to do a real quick blunt to fakie in it. So coming in sideways was just a lot easier. So that's the main two points to this video. Also learning nose grabs to fakie and learning blunt backside 180s is gonna help you. Those two tricks are definitely easier than a regular blunt. that's two tips that really helped me with blunt to fakies. If it helped at all, give it a like. If you have a question, leave that in the comment section below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this kind of content, reviews, tutorials, and videos about what I'm learning as I grow as a skateboarder, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.